All right. I think we're all set up and ready to go. I think, anyway. Well, I'm going to give it a few seconds to let some people filter into the chat. Yeah, we've got 33 people watching. Well, you know what? That's good enough for me, so let's go. Hello, Lee Ham. Evening to you, sir. Oh, hi! How the devil are you, boys? I figured a lot of people are playing Stellar Blade at the moment. Might as well give it a try, since I enjoyed the demo so much. And weirdly, it lets you pour in your data from the demo, so you don't have to do the whole, like, tutorial level. So, that makes things easier. So you guys can watch me get my ass kicked. My ass kicked by this boss. Uh, someone asked me if I finished Rebirth. Sadly, I haven't finished it yet. I'm still playing it though, and it's fantastic. Yeah, I'm on chapter nine at the moment, so it is time for some stellar boobs. Like, let's see if I can remember how to play this. So, uh, 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 uh. Definitely need a potion, though. Drink that potion. All right. <laughs> Quark says, happy 2 million subscribers. Thank you, sir. It's a pleasure to be here and be so lucky to have that many. It's, uh, it's a rare thing. It really is. Um, it was quite cool that we did it on open bar as well. Really need to get better use to the blocking. Whoa. Yeah. I don't think I'm gonna make it through this one. Whoa. Alright. Oh dear. Yes, that was not a good way to start. Gaming with Lockhart says, I've been subbed since you had 200k. God damn, man. Thank you. Yeah, you were one of the early adopters. Yeah. Apologies that I didn't do very well there. Um, I had completely see rebirth like the controls are slightly different but it's the same it's the same principles but when the controls are different you kind of get your brain into a certain way of playing and i was using the wrong button to parry here and i kept doing it knowing i was doing the wrong thing so hopefully i can get into the swing of things now Look. Uh, someone's asking is this like a souls game is it that difficult nah it's not that bad it's nowhere near as difficult as that yeah, someone's mentioning, I remember the Captain Marvel video that took off. Yeah, that was kind of what started all. And then, it was really, uh... Yeah, it was really Game of Thrones that carried on the momentum, which was nice. So, yeah, I was lucky that 2019 was kind of the year of shitty cinema, really. Oh. 
time for a little refresh. Oh, all right. See if we can get in there. Yeah, I think I need a potion here. That's more like it. Oh, shit. Alright, that should be enough. Let's kill him. There we go. That's better. I think I'm a little bit in love with Eve. This is how I like all my women, mostly naked and covered in blood. <laughs> Sorry, Mauler, I had to kill him. It, Took me two attempts, though. Goddamn, not a great way to start. It wasn't, but still so strong. Things will only get harder. Yeah, don't I know it. I'm hard already. <laughs> please show me the next route, Adam. Yes, please do. Right, hold on. Let me take a look at the map data. It's nice that she thought to wear a tie for this. You know, not enough people wear ties when they go into battle. All of records isn't too far from here, but an entire block is submerged. We have to find a way to cross. Are you saying that there's no way? I found it. I believe you in you, Eve. The stone statue. There's a transportation device there that you can use. What? You really think that these abandoned devices are still going to work? Well, Man, she's got a nice accent. <laughs> Let's just try to stay positive. Uh-huh. Positive. Sure. Hey, I feel pretty positive about this whole experience. Alright. Hoover things up, girl. Alright, do I need to take a potion? Uh... Probably not. Should be all right. All right. Ah, oh, love these moves. I'm just getting real. Uh, hi. Yeah. I wonder if I should change her outfit. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> uh, equipment exospine. Can I change it? Exterior. Uh, tactical pack, let's see, planet vibe suit, and can I unequip it? <laughs> well, you know, if you insist. <laughs> Alright, now we're talking. I will reserve the right to um, put the, the exosuit back on though when we get to our boss fight. Uh, do I need to pick this stuff up or does it just go automatically? I never can know. Uh, what is it? Bear gear change, recharges more bait energy. Alright, oh, okay, yeah, okay, fine. There we go. You have to press the button. What we got over here? Activate the camp. Sure. Do it. It's like, it's like a nice place to chill out, you know. Let's just let's have a nice sit down and replenish our supplies. There we go. While I'm doing that, a couple of super chats came in here. Uh have to catch the replay, dude. Lance doing Band of Brothers. Um, wish you were here, lol. I highly recommend Boy Kills World. It's bat pop insane, but fun. Well, thank you. Um, yeah, it's uh, one I will try to get around to. And I will actually join you guys for the um, 
for the Band of Brothers streams. I just, tonight, I had this more important thing I had to do, you know. Uh, Vladimir Taylor says, Hail Drinker, have you ever seen signs with Mel Gibson? Yes, I have. What are your thoughts? Congrats on the two mil. I remember your Disaster Artist review. By the way, how's Rogue Elements coming along? It is coming along great. Um, it's really just the, the final like VFX stuff that they have to do. It's kind of, you know, as you can imagine, it's quite bitty, like putting little gunshot wounds and blood splatters and stuff on people kind of done with VFX because we didn't have time to do it with squibs and blanks and stuff um, and it just takes time unfortunately but you know I've seen the rough cuts of it and I'm very pleased with it um, and also uh, what you're saying Mel, the signs with Mel Gibson I have indeed seen that um, I thought it was it was fine um, not the kind of movie that I, I feel compelled to rewatch, and it definitely went into the the M. Night Shyamalan um, mold of weird things but um yeah, I thought the uh, the sort of story about um, I don't know what would, what would you even call it like fate, destiny, people um, not always knowing their purpose in life and having it revealed to them at a crucial moment. Um, it's good stuff. I quite like that. Uh, Casey Boyd says, "If you and Muller have it, seen Rick and Morty, you must have all seen Bush World Adventures, right?" Well, you'd think so, but unfortunately, I haven't. I'm sorry. Ooh. A big spindly thing. Before I fight him, let's do this. Alright, oh yeah, I've got to pick him up that way. Alright, there you go. Better. Alright, where are you hiding, fella? There you are. Potion. Yeah, like I say, I do reserve the right to put the exosuit back on if I start getting my ass kicked, but for the time being, I'll let you boys enjoy it. Ooh, two of them. Oh, that's not going to go well. Right, one down. Probably stay clear of those explosions in retrospect. Alright, what have we got here? More nasties. Let's see if I can lure one away. Funnel them. Ah, there we go. Okay. I must say, I am liking this game so far. Even though I'm a bit shit at it, I will do my best to get better. Alright, what have we got? Who's there? Okay. Enkidu says the hips don't lie. That is very true. Neither do the boobs. Alright. I might put my exosuit back on for this one. I'm sorry. There we go. Just for now. Yeah, <laughs> too much clothing. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, 
I'll teach you. Oh dear. What are you all about? Right. Slight problem I've got. I'm a bit low on health. Unfortunate. Alright, let's try and get through that a bit quicker. Maybe I can rush around. Doo -doo -doo. Never sure if there's anything in these boxes. Can I dodge that guy? Yeah, that'll do. So much for sneaking around him. Alright, just go in and do my best. Roscoe is saying, is there a way to get around the censorship? Well, I think there is if you get the physical disc and then you disable updates so you don't get the day one patch. I don't know how much has been censored and how bad it is. It's kind of, uh, yeah, I'm not sure at this point. It's a bit of a shame that they've done it, though. I mean, like, ultimately, it's still a game with a whole lot of TNA in it, so can't complain too much. It's just weird that they felt like they had to change anything at all. Like, the whole reason people are supporting this so much is that it's it's not, like, the usual crap that you expect um, in modern gaming, so... Yeah, why, uh, why resort to it even just a little bit? Why bend the knee, you know? There's no need for it. But hey, thank God this game wasn't made by a Western developer. Can you imagine? Yeah, like Jedi Altair saying, install it um, and stay offline. But yeah, obviously it means if you wanted to stream it or whatever, you can't. Which is just a bit shit, really. Slowly getting the hang of it. Apologies that it took me a while to get into the swing of things. <laughs> Someone's saying, they, I would love to see the fattest version of Eve that there is out there. <laughs> yeah, count on Western developers for that. Can I open that now? Do I need a key? Is that it? Okay, let's see if I can get to this guy. Hmm. Okay. 
Okay. Can't open that right now? Nah. Yeah, man. Games like this, I just... I kind of miss them. It's nice that we're seeing them come back a little bit, because... Man, just the, the sheer ridiculous escapist fun. It's just nice sometimes to get it. Don't see it nearly enough these days. Whoa. Cool, okay. Let's go forward! Anything interesting over here? No, no, no. What's that thing? What are you? Can't operate it. Okay. Must be something lying around that I can use. Ooh, what have we got there? You don't look very friendly. Yeah. Oh, there is stuff. Nice. Really should start breaking apart these boxes more often. Yeah, someone's quite pointing out the music. It is nice and chill. Must be something with that car, because it's... Ooh, I'll have you as well. Thank you. Let's try hitting it. If in doubt, hit it. There we go. Investigate. What we got here? Fusion cell. Okay. Let's try in here. though. Oh, this is weirdly open now for some reason. Oh well, good enough for me. Yes. Shower me with stuff. Use an enhancement material for exospines. Alright, can I enhance my exospine? Let's see. Uh, I think I can probably only do that at camp. Yeah, okay. Let us go, Eve, together. That'll be a camp, then. Let's go over there and save, so... If I fuck up, which I inevitably will, I've at least got a backup. Alright, activate my camp. There you go. Activate. There. Yeah. <laughs> Suspiciously open doors. No problem! <laughs> uh, so, what's the next one? Um, yeah, I've got a few super chats here. Yeah, let me sit down in the chair and rest. For a few moments. Take the weight off, you know? Cajun Corey says, Drinker's review, jiggle physics, good. Go away now. Exactly, yeah, what more do you need? <laughs> um, Casey Boyd says, Have you started Attack on Titan Season 3 yet? No, I'm at the end of Season 2. Very good stuff. Um, actually, I actually need to get Season 3 now. Um, but yeah, I'm enjoying it. Jamaican Bacon says the plot thickens with plenty of backstory. Good stuff. Um, yeah, because it's just pretty much fight, fight, kill, kill, boobs, boobs. Which, you know, it's no bad thing. But sometimes you want a bit more in life. Jake Martin says, man, I could disappoint the hell out of this chick. <laughs> Couldn't we all, mate? Exit Music says, grats for the two million, man, you deserve it. I have a question for you. If you have to choose Eve or 2B's body, or maybe you're more into Jill and Resident Evil Revelation. <laughs> so, um, oh, Jill is pretty hot in that, actually. Who's 2B? Um, yeah, I reckon Eve. If I had to pick between the three, I might go for Eve, because she is fit. Uh, Casey Boyd says, Drinker, Mike from Red Letter Media has a cameo voice acting role in Smiling Friends if he needed a reason to watch it. Ah, that's nice to see. He's got a very distinctive voice, to be fair. Uh, Armando says, 
Auto loot items is in settings under gameplay tab. Congrats on 2 million to drinker. Oh, thank you, man. Thank you for the help. Appreciate that. Uh, I might just change that. Uh, shiny green booty, that is all. <laughs> That's all you need. And yo, how many slurpos did it cost for this slurpo? This this particular sl uh, slurpo was 60 slurpos. If you can believe it. That's a lot. Right, let's see if I can upgrade this exosuit then. Use the shop. No, ah, where are you going? I'm playing like Gary here, Jesus. Skill settings. Okay, yeah, let's see what we did here. Uh, we want to attack. Uh, bit energy recharge, assault, leaps down, this, uh, yeah, I want that. Yep, and recharges more bait energy when I attack lands, more effective than bait energy recharge one. Strengthens the last blow. Uh, let's get because we want the beta energy to recharge quickly. What else have we got here? Charges. Go up. Hits an enemy in the air and then lands. Ignores the enemy. All right, let's go with that. Uh, Burrito Man says, "Did you buy it physical or digital?" I went physical because I always do with games whenever I possibly can. Highly concentrated potion. Right, got two lingering potion. Continuously restores HP. Hmm. So resets the skill tree and refunds all SP. Nah, I don't need that. Uh, right, let's get one of you. Can I get more? Yeah. <laughs> Someone said, pick the breast enlargement perk. Now you're talking. Okay, which direction do we need to go? Anything over here that's worth investigating? Let's take a look. Whoa, probably don't want to go down there to be fair. Crate. Yeah, that guy could make life difficult, but let's give it a try. Smashing. We go here. Uh, someone asked as well um, if I'm going to review more games. Absolutely. Like I know I'm very aware that it's been a week or two since I've put any more content on the Critical Gamer, and I absolutely plan to do more, including reviewing this one. But I want to get a good few hours of this under my belt before I do a proper review on it. Because, uh, yeah, I want to keep that going. I've enjoyed making gaming content. It's been good fun. Right. What we got over here? Anything interesting? Shall we go down? Nothing bad ever happened in here. Oh, someone's saying that you, YouTube unsubbed them. That right there is unfucking acceptable. YouTube does this shit sometimes. It is a sad fact of life. I guess any channel of like any real size is gonna have it sometimes, but yeah, pisses me off all the same. Oh, can't go up there. Yeah, I think uh, in a lot of cases they're trying to do like bot clear-ups and stuff, but. Obviously, sometimes innocent people get caught in the crossfire, and that sucks. Julian Waite says, Greetings, Drinker. What's your thoughts on the Final Fantasy VII game? I absolutely love it. I think they've done a fantastic job with it, and I've very much enjoyed it. It just feels like uh, they actually put a lot of 
care into it, which is great. The combat system's good. Um, the acting's fantastic. The graphics, pretty damn good. And the actual game world is enormous. So, yeah, it just feels like a great recreation of the game. So I'm a happy guy. Uh, ooh, who are you? What are you, a ghost? Short Giraffe says, I miss the Lara Croft gameplay. Well, I miss it too. Ooh, right. Max HP increase, that's good. Yeah, I really enjoyed doing the Tomb Raider remasters. I might be convinced to play Tomb Raider 2, although my memories of that one are even hazier, so... I may get completely lost with it. It's Tomb Raider 3 that I remember being really just unfair with the puzzles. Some of them were just so obscure. You ended up thinking, like, how was I ever supposed to figure that out? <laughs> Someone's saying they can't wait to the the hard R stop in Drinker's stream. He's gonna have a pleasant surprise. Um, have they just removed the R or what? Like, ah, uh, so stupid. All of it, things like that, just boil my piss. Right. Uh, let's see. There's something down here. Oh yeah, that's the one that was closed off. So okay, I guess now that I've done everything here, as far as I can tell, then have to head the other way. Unless there's something up here. Nope, not really. No. Okay. It's it's crime R now, is it? <laughs> oh, bless them. <laughs> Those idiots. Okay, let's go and investigate the other direction then. Go, go, go. Move that sweet little ass, Eve. Someone's asked if this is the uncensored version. That's not possible. If uh, I'm streaming it online, it's automatically updated to the censored version. Which is pretty shit, but there you go. Yeah, let's see what's along here. Uh, yeah, so we want to go this way now. Yeah, Judge Boomy. What does Crimar stand for? Yeah, that's a pretty good question. No idea. Oh, hi. Okay, this should be fun. Whoa, okay. Hard charge then. Alright. Okay. Smashing. I just save it there since I've done some wandering rounds. Rest. And get your potions back. And stand. Okay, off we go. Totally got the timing all wrong there. Now I'm gonna have to use one of my potions. You gonna break open? Oh. Guess they don't like being woken up, eh? Oh, 
go there to get to the transportation device. Okay, let's go. Probably gonna need that. Some tragic stories playing out here in these little logs. Alright, time to stand up the war. There we go. <laughs> well, I do. Well, she uh, gets nice and wet. Let me just answer a couple of super chats here. So, um, Jake Baker says, "Can I get a day one patch to censor the fugly out of Western games?" Sadly, not. There's no getting rid of that. Um, Crimson Shadow. Greetings from Edinburgh. Drinker, you enjoying Stellar Blade so far? I'm loving it. So am I, mate. It's good fun. And Graham says, I wouldn't have expected you to play as Cersei from Eternals. Love the vids. Hope you're doing well, brother. Thank you, man. It's, uh, what can I say? When someone says that there's boobs in a game, I've got to get involved. Ah, so there's three attacks there, eh? Come back. Let's try that again. Guy out now. <laughs> I used a potion there. What the fuck? Son of a bitch got me before I could drink the thing. Yeah, someone mentioned so much for the separate gaming channel. So, I mean, I'll stream this to the main channel, but I will re-upload it to the gaming channel. That's how I imagined this working. Okay, finally figured out how to do it. It's definitely a learning experience. 
turns out I learn quite slowly. Kanye Southeast says, this might be a stupid question, but have you ever done a video on the Clone Wars TV show? Uh, no, mostly because I never really gave a shit about it. So, just, it's not of interest to me, so it's not really worth me covering. Okay. And over here, not really, okay. Huh, good physics there. Uh, sure, okay. <laughs> That presumably has to go in there. Nice. Road is submerged. I know, but it's our only option. <sighs> All right. Ooh. Okay. Presumably we want to move a bit quicker here, so let's see, is there a way to get out here? Let's try it. Uh, I don't know the passcode. Okay. Alright. Is there something lying about that we can find here? So, let's have a look. Oh yeah, I guess we have to go through there. Come on, turn around. There. Nano element, that's no good. Yeah, what we got? Yeah, you probably go. Right, okay, whatever. Uh, right. Whoa. SB UK. Okay, fine. I'm not really sure if she can run out of oxygen or what, but... Uh, okay. uh, let's see if I remember correctly. Okay, good. To ascend the rope, presumably. Oh yeah. <laughs> Perfect view, gentlemen. Hey, right, what have we got in here? I don't feel that that's going to blow up or something. Oh, never mind. All right. Activate the camp. Yeah! Repair console, what we got here? Uh, yeah, let's enhance. Okay, so our attack power is up. That is all good. Can't do that. Alright. Sit down for a moment, see? Take the weight off. Adam, I was very surprised when I first met you. Why? Back in the colony, we learned that everyone on Earth was completely wiped out. I'm sure it must have seemed that way. But you can't expect Mother Sphere to know everything. Then there are other survivors out there, like you. <laughs> yes, but it's rare to see them. Earth is still pretty inhospitable to humans. Hmm. Well, that is a shame. Justin Martin says, did you lock Tatiana back in the dungeon while you were playing this, or is she cool? She's pretty cool with that. You'd be surprised how open-minded Eastern European prostitutes can be. <laughs> what can I say? And Jer Reed Bear says, you know Western gaming's in trouble when Donkey Kong looks better than the female leads that we're getting now. Uh, I think you're not far off as well. <laughs> yeah, man. Talk about uglification. It is pathetic. All right. Let's carry on our little merry way. Where's, Where's the transportation our... device? Exactly. Good question, Eve. This monorail panel. Sure. 
sure thing. There is no power. <sighs> no worries. Let's check the power control room under the stairs. Let me guess, I have to go and do a whole bunch of side quests. One step forward, two steps back. You have to reorganize right. the code in order to restore power. Right. Oh, interesting. Right, so we need all of them to be up then. Yeah, okay. Uh, okay. This is where I fuck around for a bit. So it's just this one. Hmm. Okay, almost. Take you out and move you there. Oh, so close. And then there, there. Ah, hmm, almost. Okay, I wonder if I swap this one. Right there, and then you there. No. along and then you there and then you there oh. curiously so that's got to be at least there yeah so it's gonna have to be further along ah, okay Just that one that's missing. there. Uh, no. Okay, so the one's got to go at the end, presumably, because that's... And then... And then that has to go there, presumably, and then... Nope. Six there. Yay! God, it took me a while. Not gonna lie, That's I was great. slightly guessing there Try towards the end. The monorail panel again. Something is heading our way. Don't worry, it's the monorail. This ancient electronic device is our transport. Hey, you watch your tone there, right, Missy. After you. She might not look like much, but she's got a heart of electricity, I guess. Is there a way I can change her outfit mid cutscene? No. Sadly not. Oh yeah, I remember that from the demo. She was hot as well. Hmm. Just remembering something from yesterday. Hmm. 
Skeptical. Skeptical bucket man says, by the way, what is the drinker drinking right now? I've actually got a bottle of Cabernet Sauvignon. So I'm posh as fuck tonight. I'm drinking wine. What are you going to do after you defeat the Alpha Nativa? And it's going down pretty well, I'm not gonna lie. To be hot. You mean the extinction of all Nativas? Right? To think that the point of your existence is to snuff out another species. <laughs> Someone's asking, are you playing one-handed drinker by any chance? Well, that explains why I'm so shit. It's a worthwhile sacrifice. We're here. Do you want to get off? Oh yes, you better believe it, son. One legion is about the legion's eight river stations. Yeah. I wonder what happened to these poor boys. What we got in here? A mysterious box. Right, the orange suit affects Steve's appearance. You can use to design Paris right to crawl. Okay. Well, obviously, we want to face the world in style. Let's see what we got. Is that all we got? Damn it. No equipped exospines. Is there anything else we can change here? Oh, no, de no face decorations. We've only got one drone, so... Okay. Mm. Alright, we'll leave that for now. Looks like this used to be a plaza. Right. And we got a love the art deco look there. The good thing is you won't have to go in the water. The Hall of Records is that way. That is good news, I would say. Right, let's go. Someone emerged there. It was cool when those things just come to life. Let's see. Give me that. And let's kill these boxes here. Okay, onward. All oh, right, we need the passcode. As I thought, it's locked. Security you code. Don't say. We have no choice but to search them all. Let's look for the Legion in the square building. Okay. Can we buy things from the shop? Like sexy underwear or something. Uh, concentrated potion, lingering potion. No. Just fighty, shooty, shooty stuff. Okay. Carry on. It might be best to stay away from the water. Looks like there's electricity running through it. Hmm. Oh. 
It's really satisfying the way they crumble like that. So, don't want to go in the water because apparently it's electrified. So we need to find the passcode from a dead soldier. Nice. in here? No. Alright. So we're gonna have to go in there, I guess. Take a moment to appreciate that scenery though. Yeah. That does look good. Oh yeah, so just like for people who don't know about it, and I'm sure you all do, I now have a gaming channel called The Critical Gamer because I've got no imagination, and that's where I'll be putting all my live stream uploads of like any video games and my reviews for games all that sort of thing so if you haven't subscribed might be worth checking it out and here oh yeah if in doubt look for the yellow things So you can't block that then, okay. Bad move on my part. Right, have you got it? Have you got our passcode? I see a hidden note here. Okay, that sounds like it. Let's go back. To collect. Yeah, let's just do that actually. Uh, settings, gameplay, difficulty normal, blah blah blah. Controls, where is it? Auto lock on, no, 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 it's not there. Gameplay, yeah. auto loot items, there we go. Okay. Let's see if I remember the codes. So, uh, hey, not bad for a drunk guy. Shopping done. Yeah, I said it to a short ponytail so we could get a better view of her ass. Because people advised me to do it, and you know what? Who am I to argue? Truly, who am I? I want to provide you guys with the best user experience possible. Alright, is it possible to change anything here? Repair console? I don't know. Oh yeah, here we go. Equip, so... Ooh, I like that one. Craft it. Ah, oh, I don't have enough materials. God damn it. See, I feel like this has been changed as well. Damn it. I can't make our boobs any bigger, unfortunately. I am really sorry about that. You know what I can do? And remove the nano suit for now. There we go. Just enjoy yourselves for a bit, you know. This one's on me, gentlemen. Probably gonna get killed now, but that's okay, you know. I'll do it for you guys. Uh, let's rest so we can get our potions back. Adam, do 
you meet every <laughs> members from the colony often? <laughs> oh, this is a nice cutscene. Not really. I'm gonna pour myself yes, another drink while we're running this, boys. Area. I've never seen such a large scale airborne operation. Why did you save me? I mean, have you oh, seen her? Sure. It just felt right. Like I was meant to. It's hard to describe. It's just a short, intense feeling. I felt all the electricity going to my nether regions. What can I say? Um, Kendon B says, You like gin? I had James May's gin, and it's great. Ah, James May's making gin. That's pretty cool, actually. Uh, yeah, I do enjoy a bit of gin, actually. Um, Tankery Sevilla Orange is my favorite, but uh, Whitley Neal is pretty good as well. Jimber Jamber says, Cheers, Drunkler. Just got back from seeing The Mummy for its 25th anniversary. Then I'm seeing Alien tomorrow for its 45th. Enjoy the bobs. <laughs> Thank you, man. And uh, yeah, The Mummy. God, that's a good film. I miss just adventure movies like that. They're great. The coconut gave me a nice little, a uh, nice little super sticker there. So thank you. Anyway, stand up. Let's carry on our way, Eve. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we came in from there, so let's go this way. Well, that doesn't sound good. from a pro. Alright, good. <laughs> See, we got no armor on, but you know what? That forces you to be a little bit more cautious, so maybe that's no bad thing. And it's worth it. Anything over here? Anything over here? Nope. Ah, yep. What have you got? Uh, right. Thank you for your service, sir. Right. Up. Show me the ledge, baby. Nano elements. Okay, nothing else here that we need to worry about. Oh yeah, I can do a jumpy thing. Here, how do you do this again? Ah, I think it'll happen while you're in the air. And I kind of got caught in the scenery, but that's okay. Okay. Yeah, I don't want to go that way. Okay, let's go. Uh, it's a bit too far for oh. that. How about you try jumping and dashing? Okay, I will. Let's try that again. Go, up the ladder. Up, Eve. So you can dash while in the air. Okay. did it so why did it not work you have to hold it down maybe just to give it an extra boost <laughs> yeah as someone's pointed out she is wearing high heels to go into combat it's definitely a choice. It's a choice, all right. <laughs> There's any ladies here? All right, so... No. Oh, okay. No, that didn't work. What am I missing there? You have to jump and then press circle to dash. 
Uh, yeah, if there's any ladies that have served in the military, perhaps you can verify for me. Do you guys go into combat wearing high heels? Because I am convinced that you do, in fact, and you're just hiding it. Okay, so... Dash in the air. Oh, there we go. Okay. Just a question of timing, I suppose, and I didn't get it right. Never mind. Lesson learned. That was a strange line of dialogue. Okay. Forward Eve. Let's go together. Anything over here? Anything underneath me? Some interesting music. It's really funky stuff. It's not like, uh, yeah, it's not like the kind of super dramatic orchestral stuff you might expect for a game like this. It's, it's just kind of chill, you know. We're going through a post-apocalyptic wasteland, killing enemies and fighting for our lives. That's all right, though. I like some nice chill music to serenade me. Oh, hi. Decided to join the party, have you? Yeah, it does seem a bit like elevator music, as someone pointed out. Okay, we need the passcode. I need a four-digit password. Uh, another headache. Okay, this sign reads time. Could this be connected to the clock tower? <laughs> hmm, I wonder if it could. All right, where's the clock tower from here? So, what does it say? Uh, so that's like five o'clock. So if we put that into military time, what's that, 1700? Try it. No, okay. Mm, try it as that. Maybe it was slightly past, so like 1701. Huh, okay, let's take a quick look at that again. Uh, oh, maybe it's the other way around, so it's like 12, uh, okay, 1225. Yeah, okay. I was looking at the hands the wrong way. That's better. Oh, drink her, you silly sausage. Right. Oh. It's cool if you come at the, r the ladder from the wrong side, she'll just like grab the rung and swing herself around it. Just a neat, neat little detail. I like that. Almost there now. Oh, don't worry. I'm sure something else will get in the way. <laughs> Probably a bit far to jump there. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't go that way. Yeah, this is where we need to go. Right. 
lots of swag. Okay, let's carry on down. <laughs> Respect my hotness, vile beast. Oh, don't worry, we're respecting it, all right. I'm gonna get another little charming cutscene there. Have yourself a sit down. Let's see what you've got to say for yourself. Very good. All right, might have to put the nano suit back on, I suspect, because there's probably gonna be some combat coming up here if we're if we're having to save our game like this. And up. What have we got here? Memory tower. The Hall of Records is under there. Look at that gigantic hard erection going up into the sky. Fuck you! Nipping at me like that, you little shit. Alright, time to put this back on, because I'm gonna need it for now. Uh, pretty sure I tried. I blocked that, but never mind. No, you don't, you shit. Fusion drive, eh? Ooh, okay. Uh, underground memory tower. So, what, is, what do we want here? So, AU. Okay. Oh! the code to the power control room. Well, that's handy. Alright, so we need to go... Happening. Oh, it wasn't like this before. So we need to go to the power control the room then. Was put through a reset when the power was cut off. We'll have to verify the credentials once power is restored. Why don't we force our way in? Let's not do that. If the safety system goes off, we'll never be able to enter. So I'm guessing the power control room is this. Oh no, it's not. Let's look around the Victory Monument first. So these stairs lead to the power control room. All right, let's go. I need a fusion core then. It looks like the fusion cell's dead. Wait, I'm sensing another fusion cell around here. Yeah. Uh, let's see if I remembered this right. Yes. You know, I might not be very good at gaming, but I can remember combinations fairly well. I mean, that's got to be a skill of some sort, I suppose. Great. Power has been restored. Let's find a Legion soldier with access codes. <laughs> right, so we need a dead soldier? 
pretty sure we looked around here fairly comprehensively, but okay, let's try again. Is it worth looking down here? No, nope, can't go down there. Let's look around the victory monument. Alright, there we go. I scanned the credentials. Okay, so this will work then, presumably. We'll head down to the Hall of Records now. Sounds like a plan, sir. Idos, what the fuck? Nice place you got here. Boom. All right, let's go. This is quite the place. I can't believe we're in the Hall of Records. It's like a dream. Now, all we have to do is find the hyperdrive. Buster Voodoo says, This is one of those Souls-type games where you have to ki try a million times to kill one enemy. Uh, no, it's not meant to be like that. It's just because I'm horrendously bad at this. At the start of the 22nd century, humanity's right to life was threatened by advanced global warming. Having foreseen this... Literally, I can't turn or anything. All I can do is walk forward. <laughs> Why is the game even letting me control her if I can't do anything? ...resolved near instantly. Right, before we carry on, let's uh, let's make this more enjoyable. There we go. There we the go. The body cell replaced the heart and made it possible to survive in environments without oxygen or water. Thanks to advances in biotechnology and nanotechnology, the inconveniences of aging and disease were... <laughs> the there you this go, boys. ...giant leaps forward in the development of hazardous industrial spaces and space itself. We can now withstand the crushing pressures of the deepest oceans and even exit a space station without the need of a spacesuit. Oh, there we go. Now I can control her. Feels like this room is just a bit unnecessarily big. I mean, look at it. Humanity's greatest and only hope for survival can be found in Mother Sphere. Please. Enjoy the harmony and prosperity of Ados 7, the first city ever built by Mother Sphere, the mother of... I have no idea what that was all about. Me neither. Adam, did it make any sense to you? Mankind's past... I'd like to answer you, but Final there's no more blood left in my brain if you catch my drift. This must be a video from before that time. Hypercell. Is this what you're looking for? Sure hope so. Yes, you can extract it from the hyperdrive. Great, we accomplished our first objective. Well, happy days. Let's go before the emergency power runs out. to do a lot of good. Yes, good. Thank you. Um, okay. Then, can you tell me where the Alphenitiba is? <laughs> of course. It isn't far. I sense we're going to have a boss battle coming up soon. It's been a bit quiet for a while. <laughs> All right, that's enough of this nonsense. <laughs> now we can go this way. All right, let's go. Wow, imagine my surprise. <laughs> what is that thing? 
What even are you? Supposed to do to tackle this guy. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be getting through this one. Ah! I right, was try again. Okay, so where are we going from here? Wait, where is this? Wait, it's not going to make me, uh... Hold on. Uh, manual. Huh. Strange. So where is going to make me go here? Yeah, it's not going to make me do that whole section again, surely. Because it saved my game after I'd gotten through that bit. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Unless it's just like... Alright, oh, okay, yeah. So it's fine, I've done that whole section, it's just I have to get back to where I was, that's all. Yeah, it seems a bit pointless, but okay, fine. Damn, this guy hits hard. Whoa. Okay. Might be third time's a charm on this one. Definitely glad I didn't try and do that without my bodysuit. That would have been distinctly lacking in fun. I love how he just spews toxic waste at you, though. Uh, actually, there's maybe there's a way to add uh, something to my uh, ammo design skills. No, I don't want that data bank. Manual settings, controls. Hmm. 
Get back. Yeah, I do trust the power of TNA. I just don't trust the power of my gaming skills. Come on, you got me when I was trying to take the potion. God damn it. Yeah, I kind of got the, what they were going for there, though. Yeah. Third time wasn't the charm, sadly, but I at least kind of understand how to get them this time. Maybe it is a bit more like the Souls games. You have to work at it a little bit. Which there was a way to skip the cutscene though. Almost. God, that, that guy's tough. He is a tough fighter. Hits really hard. Um, the problem is as well, you can kind of get behind him, try and attack him from behind, or you can parry him, but it's difficult to do both at the same time, and it kind of depends on you getting a feel for what kind of attack he's going to do. Only thing to do is have another bash.
now. Son of a bitch. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get this one. of a bitch what I was actually trying to do there as well is uh, no 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 I don't want to sit down fuck up yeah what I was trying to do there was change up my um, health items that I had alright fuck right I'm screwed then I'll give it a couple more attempts. If I can't get past it, I'll probably call it for the night and then pick it up again next time. No, 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 no! Oh. <laughs> I was really close there, motherfucker. Alright. Despite what I said last time, I'll give it one more shot, because... This guy's pissing me off now.
Ah, oh, I was so close. I think I may have to finish it up for now, because I probably need to come out of this fresh, I reckon. Uh, let me just do a couple of odd um, super chats before I finish up here. Um, yeah, what was it? Admin says, Eve's got a lot of white splooge on that scene. Not to worry, I'm sure many PC screens have suffered the same fate. Indeed, yeah, especially with this game. Young Jeff A says, would you recommend getting this game? I would, yeah. I mean, it's pretty challenging, as you've seen. Um, but I think I need to come at it with the right mindset and be perhaps either more or less drunk when I do it next time. And Ian so forth, gifted 10 critical drinker memberships. Thank you, man. And... Chibi Ashawan said, Good luck! Thank you! I appreciate that, man. Unfortunately, luck wasn't on my side this evening, but yeah, I'll stream it again next time and we'll see how we do. But for now, I think that is all I've got for today. So go away now.